The Missouri River system, which includes Lakes Akakawea and Oahe, could have some concerns with boat ramps later this summer because of the lack of precipitation. The snowpack in Montana right now is, is weak. I mean, we're at 60, 70% of normal for snowpack coming into Sakakawea. That should hold its own throughout the year. Um, the Missouri River is dependent on what they let out of Sakakawea that comes past Bismarck here and into the headwaters of Oahe. Um, even those ramps are probably gonna be all right. I'd say Lake Oahe is probably the one that's a little bit more in jeopardy. It's proposed to drop about 10 feet between now and fall. And if it does that, you know, we're gonna lose some boat ramps and some major important boat ramps on that and be down to some low water stuff. Devil's Lake water levels are exactly where they were last year at this time. I don't suspect we're gonna see much for, for planes runoff. We've currently got nine of the 10 ramps that are on the lake that are usable. And they're, they're all gonna be usable throughout the 24 season. Freilich says if we don't get any precipitation and have hot temperatures, some of our district lakes could also have access issues later this summer. And there's also new projects planned this summer for North Dakota Game and Fish Department's fisheries development crews. We've currently got about a dozen brand new boat ramps scheduled. Of those, five of them are brand new ramps, two or three of them are revamping existing ramps that have been out there and outlived their useful life. And then a couple of them are primitive boat ramps, which are just gravel boat ramps to get people into some of these newer fisheries. And then we've got a couple ramp extension projects. Overall, things are looking okay for boating access on our lakes and rivers in North Dakota. We've got 430 active fishing waters out there right now and about 350 boat ramps. So, you know, we're, we're in pretty good shape for access. Uh, docks are looking good. Uh, piers, we've got 150, 60 piers out there. And uh, yeah, everybody should be happy. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.